Between August 21st and August 25th, chaos swept across American campuses. Students were locked down in classrooms, police armed to the teeth, storming libraries, parents were glued to their phones in horror. Ten U.S. universities, from Tennessee to Colorado, became unwilling stages in a terrifying new kind of cyber-enabled attack. So what happened? At least ten U.S. universities received chilling emergency calls. The voice on the line claimed there was an active shooter. Dispatchers, trained to respond quickly, had no choice but to believe. But it was all fake. AI-driven panic attacks targeting financial districts, transportation hubs, or critical infrastructure. In fact, AI has lowered the barrier to entry for psychological warfare. It's almost impossible to tell a fake call from a real one in the heat of the moment. Dispatchers do not have minutes to analyze audio. They have seconds. And AI makes those seconds deadly. At the end, purgatory's attacks show us something chilling. When criminals weaponize artificial intelligence, fear itself becomes a service you can buy. The sound of chaos can be fabricated, the presence of danger can be simulated, and institutions we rely on to protect us can be thrown into what we call disarray, with just a single call. 